this little boy is probably in his 40s now, uh, but I've never forgotten him. This poem's called Robert's Train. Bare floors had Robert's house, and you wouldn't sit on the chairs, and the whole place smelled of urine, and there were jagged holes in the stairs. Santa's going to bring me a train, miss. Electric with loads of rails and engines that pull all the carriages. It'll be bigger and better than Dale's. Dale says, I've got loads of engines and trucks that carry the coal. And Wayne's got bridges and tunnels. You can watch them come out of the hole. Robert's knees hang out of his trousers and the soles on his shoes flap about. And his coat, well, he hasn't got one. He's a tough little lad when he's out. Santa's going to bring me a train, miss. It'll go right fast and all. Santa's going to bring me a train, miss. I'll draw a picture to put on the wall. His mum dances topless twice nightly. His dad lives three streets away. He's Dale's dad now, he says brightly. Santa will come on his sleigh. Christmas is lovely in my home. The trees stand sparkling and tall. The table is laden with goodies and brightly wrapped presents for all. But as I serve Christmas dinner, part of me fills with pain. An ache in my heart keeps returning and one thought keeps filling my brain. When Robert woke up this morning, had Santa left him a train? We returned in the new year, and the children wrote all their news. Robert was quiet, not writing, but I noticed a new pair of shoes. I got a watch, miss, he said proudly, holding his arm up high. And I looked at the watch with interest, my lips ready forming a reply. But Robert, the hour hand's missing. I said with a sinking heart. I know, said Robert, rapidly blinking, but the big hand tells me apart. I know when it's quarter to something, and I know when it's quarter past. And Santa, well, he brought it for me, and I didn't even ask. Oh.